Well, you know what I say. What? Well, f*** them. Let's yeah. do what the f*** we want. Yeah. I'm not going to change who we are because we're not getting views. F*** it. Views will come. If we just keep doing what we love to do. I hope the views come back. Cold open. Cold open. Right there. Cold open. If people don't like our cold opens, I don't give a f***. If you're one of the people that skips our cold opens, uh... Okay. Okay. You're still watching. <laughs> to the people who do watch. <laughs> Thank you. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh. Gross. What's up, guys? Welcome back to Slam and Tim, and I'm Mikey Fish. Uh, maybe. I was trying to give you a high five. Huh? Yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Very excited about today. Yeah. Per usual. Per usual. Man, you know we've talked about it before. We love this MySpace revival. Revival. It's fantastic. It's, it's great. It's nostalgic. It's it's nostalgic as. F <laughs> and this is no exception. Not at all. Not at all. This band has been making some moves. Uh, I've making been hearing waves. their name thrown around a, a, a whole lot. And I've heard them, but I haven't listened. You know what I mean? Mm. I've heard them, but I haven't listened. I haven't focused. Yeah. And so today is going to be the day I do that. And I'm very excited about it. These are young people. Oh, yeah. Young very, cats. very young. And to, to, to hear all these people throw their name around like this is the band you need to be listening to, or one of the bands you need to be listening to, along with... Lilith's Demise. Revenant. Revenant. Oh, uh, Reverent. Reverent. Re Reverent. 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 Uh, which I did one of their episodes, or mm -hmm. one of their songs. So good. Girl of Glass. Just all these bands, and they say, check this one out. And I'm doing it, and you're doing it. I'm doing it. And we're doing it right now. We're doing it And together. so, let's just do it. Let's just do it. I'm very, very excited about this. Anytime I get to hear a MySpace Deathcore revival band, I'm all for it. Yeah. So I'm what are we doing? On this. What are we doing today? We are doing the song, "The Seven Works of Mercy," by the band Victim Blamed. Now this is a very young band from here, Texas. From and Texas? From Texas, I think San Antonio. And I actually ran into these these kids. They were at a uh, Knock Loose when I was working knock loose at Stubbs. Very fucking cool, very chill. They recognized me, so that was That's cool. Sick. Yeah, so I was like, yeah. From here? Yeah. From Slam and Salmon or what? I think it was from Slam and Salmon. I don't or know, I don't know from what else. Purifier Pure Fire or what? They, they've heard of Pure Fire, but they were like, we've never seen y'all play, so that's cool. Like, like yeah. we wanna get to know you. And so yeah, we traded info and yeah, they're very sweet dudes. I can't wait because I've actually heard some of their stuff before and apparently they've gotten better. Well, let's like, hear it. Way better. So this, has been out, this has been out for like a month. Uh, we're a little late on this one, but yeah. that's all right. Okay, here I we go. I think it's been a month. Maybe, I, I think I read a month. Whatever. Let's fucking go. Just baggy straight cut jeans. Uh huh. <laughs> and skinny jeans with the yeah uh, the knees blown out. Of course. That looks like Lewis. What did I say? That's hilarious. <laughs> you did tell me that before we started. Same 
fucking nose is blue. <laughs> Fun man. Oop, wrong thing. Did give me that. Insane. Dude, what a blast, man! <laughs> that just oh my gosh, like seeing it, hearing it's one thing, but seeing it, these young people just it reminded me so much of our time. Dude, literally that. that that underpass uh, view of them playing that reminded yeah. me of that underpass in Georgetown we took promos at once. That's hilarious. Yeah, <laughs> it also reminded me of uh, there was a bunch of music videos that did that, but uh, there was like a. Uh, was it Bleed From Within's early stuff? I think they mm -hmm. did a music video like that. There was a bunch of them back then that did that exact style of uh, that location. Like Blood Runs Black. Bunch of them. Yeah. And uh, man, what a blast, dude. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, uh, they did it. I know the exact video that I'm going to tell you to splice in right here of Luis. <laughs> Or Lewis, uh, he, we called him Lewis, but uh, he looks just like that guitar dude, player. Dude, literally, right? And just the nose, the hair. Oh my god, dude! That's dude. Yeah. L Lewis was the vocalist of our old band. Uh, oh, Sydney Shaw. Yeah, Sydney Shaw. If uh, for all the MySpace Deathcore revival fans, go check out Sydney Shaw. God that was our band. I mean, it was it was MySpace Deathcore. It was MySpace Deathcore. We'll put a little. We'll put a little. Snippet right here. Ten like not even ten seconds, yeah, like just... two seconds right here. <laughs> Dude, what that's so cool, man. The little bell. Bing. Dude, the bell. Uh and the fact that they brought back the melody when it was mm -hmm. even slower, breakdown, like That's what I'm saying, dude. It reminds me a lot of okay, this is gonna sound weird. You know synth wave, right? Mm. Synthwave is basically trying to embody the sound of the 80s, and it almost sounds more like the 80s than the 80s does. Yeah, it's it's nostalgic aesthetic. It's, yeah, it, it, it's almost like a, I don't want to say a cosplay, because that sounds mean, because that's not the, the idea I'm going it's, for. It's a reboot. Yeah, it, it's, now that Deathcore, MySpace Deathcore has ended, it's giving people time to study what it was, mm. and it seems like people know, it, these bands know exactly what, yeah. like, what worked. They literally pick the best parts from the best Deathcore songs, it's like, what if we redid that, but with that also yeah. sick part? And this really together. cool part from, from uh, Rain Boots, and then mixed it with this really, really cool part from Postmortem Promises yeah. and just put it together. And it's like, yeah, dude. Yeah, straight up. I mean, I saw a live video, I believe it was this band, and they did Sky's Most Wanted Goodbyes by We Are The End. Mm -hmm. And it's like, they truly it's are- like, how the f do y'all know that? Yeah, like, it's straight like, up. They are truly giving a f about the underground deathcore scene. Yeah. And it's like, it's so cool and it's getting popular and it's, I'm happy with it. I'm not gonna gatekeep that shit. Come on. No, yeah, we need more of that. Yeah, we need more people fucking with that shit and putting it in other things. And we too. said we we called it how long ago? Oh. That this was gonna happen. We've been saying it. Because I mean, we yeah, we've been saying it, but like for the past couple years, we're like it's coming back. And it's gonna happen, and now it's in full like. Mm hmm. Oh, uh, it's so freaking nuts. Like I said, I I like I said in the last episode, I have a new Instagram out. Mm. That's called my deathcore space, and it's me posting death all deathcore yeah. bands that we that we used to listen to. Yeah, that we would find off of totaldeathcore.com. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I don't know if anyone knows that one. 
check out totaldeathcore.com. I don't even know if it's still around anymore. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. But, dude, it's like seeing like the suggestions of like the new bands like to follow. Mm -hmm. Whenever I started that, because I do the hashtag MySpace Deathcore and blah blah blah. It's like giving me these bands, and it's hundreds mm. of. I say hundreds, not hundreds, but it's so many new MySpace revival bands and it's yeah. it's so cool and they're doing the funny names it, oh yeah I'm, the song titles yes. like the really long ones and it's ah it's just welcome welcome, welcome. dude welcome welcome we op we, we welcome you with open arms oh I'm dude British. that was fun victim blame you're doing it right and I'm, I'm proud of you. Absolutely. Yeah, no, we, we need more of it. And I want to see it. And I, oh, the shows, like the fact that it's, it's funny. Like I've been like seeing videos of their shows and whatnot. It's like, it's starting off at like small clubs and whatnot, but then like, they also do like the tunnel shows mm -hmm. and that's like, that's punk as fuck. Yeah. It's like fucking keep doing that, build your own DIY space, and then, then yeah, you'll be unstoppable. Exactly. With the only thing I'm gonna say, and they might be doing it, and I just haven't caught it yet, but to the new revival bands, let me get a bro walk in there. A bro walk? Let me get a couple bro walks in there. Remember the bro walk? Yeah, the... Let me get some of them. Let me get that jogging in place. Jog in place, Dude, yeah. that's all I need. And then y'all got it. Yeah. They well, might well, be doing it already. They, I don't know. They, they probably, uh, yeah, all, like, everyone in the band. Yeah, all, well, all the all the string players. All the string players. And the, the vocalists. The two guitars wants. and basses have to be in sync, jogging yeah. in place. Dude, good job. I loved it. Amazing shit. That was shit. so much fun. Uh, I have nothing else to say. It's all either. been good. <laughs> Dude, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Be sure to follow Victim Blame on all those social media platforms. They definitely deserve it. While you're at it, if you got time, follow us on ours. Be sure to comment, like, and bro walk all over that subscribe button. <laughs>